Seasonable Harris isn't just a great place to go to the beach, it's a great place to find amazing food. Here are some of our local food favorites. Our first stop is right off Calle Bravo, right in between the church and the basketball court. So pays are 15 pesos and quesadillas are 25. I love so pays. They're so good. Ah, that's good. Giving them lots of flavor. They're really good. And then the quesadilla. Ooh. Try it. The little stand by the church was definitely worth a visit. Next, we go to Pope Chook on the corner of Abasolo and Juarez. This is Pope Chook. It means Mayan pork chop. We eat here all the time because they have one of the best sopa de limas on the entire island. The prices are great. Sopa de lima is lime soup with tortillas and a whole bunch of chicken and vegetables in it. Mm. Yum. The lime are amazing in this soup. It has a bite. It's really good. <laughs> and the tortillas, well, you know, I love everything deep fried, so it adds extra flavor. Tostadas, they're fantastic. Chicken, cheese, lettuce, and crunchy. This is the quesadilla no poch. Which means, I'm not sure. Oh, cheese. <laughs> Lots of cheese. A very thick uh, tortilla, homemade tortilla. Has lots of flavor. We need to open a website for you called lotsofflavor.com. <laughs> another day at Pokchuk and another couple of our favorites. This is a big meal even for me. It's called the Tampiqueña. It's 120 pesos. You get a chicken enchilada with mole, a cheese quesadilla, french fries, rice, salad, guacamole, and a big old flank steak. This is choleta de porco. One of my favorites, it's a pork chop. It has lots and lots of flavor with sauteed onions. Mm. Great food, great price, open day and night. <laughs> There are several little luncherias in the parking lot of the Mercado Municipal along Avenida Guerrero, but Alexia and Giovanni, also known as the Pink Place, is our favorite. These are huevos rancheros. Mm. The sauce is really good. It has lots of different flavors too. I just got the standard ham and cheese omelet. Always a winner. These are chicken flautas. Oh wow. The flavor is really good. These are some of the best ones we've had. These are so good. <laughs> I don't know if this is a pro tip or not. Tortillas. I make omelet tacos. A little piece of omelet. A little rice. A little habanero. Omelet tacos. For the absolute best food on the island, head down to the plaza. We're on the plaza and every night they set up street carts and with food in them. <laughs> oh. The best I mean, food in And that sauce is like fire in a cup. I love it. This is good. Salute. Mm. Really good. Lots of flavor and warm. These are the panuchos. The panuchos have beans inside of the tortilla. Crunchy. Which one do you want? I want one of each. <laughs> this place is hard to beat. It, oh, the, best. the food is so good. It cost 120 pesos, which is like six bucks for two plates of amazing food. They're right in front of this market. We couldn't resist. We came back for more. These are empanadas. The flavor, as always. And those are yet more flautas. That's mine. Oh, oh, oh. I'm all excited. Gracias. So we got cheesecake from that fabulous place we had all that food tonight. This one doesn't have a crust. Mm. 
really creamy. Oh yeah, need cheesecake? Go there. When you've got to have a roasted chicken, head to Avenida Guerrero. This is the best rotisserie chicken on the island. They've been here 26 years. It's 165 pesos for a full chicken. Yeah, chicken, rice, beans, spaghetti, salsa, and lots of tortillas. Oh yeah, great flavor. If you're out late and you've got the munchies, have we got a treat for you. On Avenida Lopez Mateos, which is the northmost uh, road on the island, for some reason there are hot dog stands and they are all wrapped in meat. If you're craving like a crazy wrapped in bacon hot dog, this is the place to come. They're pretty good. There's lots of great food choices along Avenida Guerrero and this is one of the best anytime. We were at Ruben's. They're open breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Ruben's really nice. He gives back to the community, and the food is great. These are chilaquiles. They're not usually that red, but uh, they're like breakfast nachos. These are flautas. They're deep fried um, with meat in the middle, and they had meat and cheese put in this one. They look like taquitos. Yeah, with the green sauce. Do you want something else? Mm. Crunchy with a lot of flavor. Oh, those are tostadas. Mm -hmm. I, I don't even know why I pretend that you're ordering those. I'm the one that over ordered. Yeah, but I get to try them. Really good, creamy, with lots of vegetables. A really good place to eat. And it's like four dollars a plate. And you get filled up. <laughs> this little cart is tucked away on the street, right next to the ice cream shop La Michoacana. Having sopes and quesadillas. And quesadillas. <laughs> These are sopes and they are a little thicker tortilla with an edge on them. And they put um, beans and chicken and these are my one of my favorite things to eat. Cheese. These are good. Ooh, that pollo is salty. Which is chicken. They're good. Not the best, but good. Uh, 15 pesos a piece for those and then 25 for the quesadilla. And then I get a quesadilla. It's just. Ooh, wow, that looks quite good. I thought it was just cheese. That's good. Yeah, I'd eat here again. This isn't generally considered local food, but the owner's local. And this pizza is fantastic. This is Oscar's and they have lots of stuff, but we really only come here for their pizza. They also deliver, so it's dangerous. That one is gluten free. The pepperoni is greasy and the Pineapple is sweet and they add basil to it. It's really fresh basil. It's fantastic. This is really good pizza. Here's our favorite place to watch any sporting events we just can't do without. I think we're going to try the burgers at this new sports bar called Snappers. We've tried their chicken wings and they are awesome. Fries are great, burgers are pretty good. I like it. Winding down our list brings us to our second favorite cafe on the island. We're at Cafe Modagua for their famous frappuccino. Oh yeah, that's, that's fantastic. And they're 80 pesos. <laughs> Drum roll please. This is it, our favorite cafe. And the 
another frappe because you know we love our frappe. Let's see how this one is. Rich, creamy. This is a good one. Keep drinking this coffee. <laughs> Click the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>